open-minded. Um, it, it is a, a journey. It's not something you just come and learn and you can take away. Uh, it's, it's a journey of discovery. There's a lot of work to cover in a relatively sort of short period of time whilst dealing with uh, you know, work and, and family, so it's getting that balance right, so you need to be super organised. There's a big time commitment um, that you need to make and you need to just ensure that you've got that space and time to reflect and commit fully to the learning experience and journey. So my learning experience at Henley has been really enjoyable so far. It's been a it's been an interesting piece with COVID and remote learning, but actually coming into the college and actually doing um, two face-to-face -face modules has been like really interesting to get that debate and um, have that real kind of insightful conversation with with team members has been been really valuable. So my learning experience has been fantastic. You know the, the the content which we've covered. So we're in our second module now, we're moving into our third module, but the content's been fantastic. It, it's really opened up uh, sort of my mind to new ideas, different models. You know, I think the, the key for me is it's very shade of grey. You know, it's not a black and white, and there's so many uh, you know, sort of different ways to view, view things. So uh, it, it's been a great learning experience so far. It's been intense, but it's been it's been fantastic. In terms of applying the knowledge I've learned uh, <clears throat> on the course, I think I've been a very fortunate. Uh, of circumstances at the moment because there's so much change going on within the organisation uh, which has led to a lot of change. I've presented back a number of papers already uh, and we're actually actioning some of those projects um, through which has been kind of quite insightful for me as a, as a person but actually for the business as well. Um, you know, we could save our business a, a significant amount of money over the next couple of years with some of the learnings we've taken from Manly. This program has given me a mass, massive confidence boost. Uh, so when I talk to uh, other managers or senior leaders, I feel a lot more confident about what I'm talking about. I think those on the, my team that I'm working with have noticed that I have become more reflective in my approach and I also encourage them to do the same. And I'm asking them more questions around how might we do things better or differently. And more importantly, allowing people time and space to be creative and not just take the first answer that we come up with. My line manager has commented about the way I've stepped back a little bit and actually um, given things a bit more thought. We're very busy as a business, we you know, jump from one project to another, but actually taking time to step back, reflect and use some of the learning from the course has enabled me to, I guess, drive things forward in a bit more of a strategic and controlled way. I think it's really a valuable course. I'm learning an awful lot of uh, new things, covering over some old ground as well, but, but it's really given me a, a much broader perspective in terms of, of business and uh, it's, it's really helping in terms of, you know, I think my personal development and also, uh, you know, my career and what I can bring back to the organisation. Completing the Henley Senior Leadership Apprenticeship has meant that I can really step back from my business day-to-day -day work and actually focus on how we change and develop the business and really take it a step forward. So I'd like to thank the business for allowing me to take time out of my work. I'm incredibly busy in work, so my line manager, Alana Woods, has been fantastic at enabling me to step back and allowing me to give myself permission to focus on, uh, on study because the business sort of sees the benefits that I actually provide as part of the course. So whilst I get a lot of it, the business is also seeing, seeing that as well. I think I'm very thankful for my line manager, uh, you know, Ian Pope. I think that uh, he's been very supportive in terms of my development, provided the opportunities, I think, for me to uh, sort of you know, give the time to sort of to uh, to focus on the course, uh, but also given the opportunities, as I mentioned before, to be able to apply some of those uh, things I've been learning on the on the course. I think he's the, he's the main person in terms of you know I think from, from a wider beep, I think just providing the opportunity actually that uh, you know putting this course on, um, you know I think that we're really thankful for for it. I'd like to thank Bupa for opening up this opportunity to me. I never went to university before, so I would never have applied or put myself in this position if it wasn't for the business having this as a, an option for me. The people I want to thank, first, first of all, is my wife. Uh, massive thank, thank you to her for, for her support, um, but also for Bupa for offering me this opportunity. And finally, for, for all the faculty in Hanley Business School for being so supportive.